What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. Today I want to talk about VIP Shop Management versus Shop Monkey for the last time, I promise. Um, uh, this video is a little bit different than before. Uh, since before we were comparing VIP Shop Management to Shop Monkey and Shop Monkey like was a cloud version and VIP was not. And now VIP is a cloud version. We tested it and it works perfectly. I love it. Um, we have users for that. Uh, the reason that I did act on uh, on the, the, the cloud uh, right away is because of the future. What's coming in the future um, is the internet speed is getting super fast and that's, that's the future, meaning that uh, like it, having your data on the cloud and not have to worry about it uh, versus having it on your computer, it's a big deal and sharing the data, that's another major issue. Um, to instead of logging in and, and getting to your uh, uh, to your uh, data, you have to install and connectivity and all that. Uh, even though it got better throughout the years, but it's still like it's a hassle, uh, especially for the customers. Uh, they're not computer savvy, and that's when when this plays a role, a big role. Where where uh, where cloud, you just log in, you just download the application and log in so i'm glad that we got this part fixed uh for people who are using it right now and they have fast internet at home oh it's a big deal and uh, for people who are not who don't have uh, fast internet we still have the one-time payment 350 dollars which is really good it works great and uh and the good news is all our customers <coughs> all our customers that have the one-time payment um uh, it's not a big deal to them in the end because they can always switch to uh, the cloud just they have to let us know and because their, their, their data is just matching the cloud data so there's no changes whatsoever. Uh, that's why I did that, that, the harsh move, uh, literally I call it a, a step forward and a step backward at the same time. Rewriting the software in 90 days, that was crazy. Um, uh, we had literally instead of like moving forward, we really had to take a step backward, but it wasn't necessarily an important step backward uh, to make sure that VIP can run on the cloud uh, for, for new users and for our existing users at some point when they want to switch to the cloud, especially with the 5G, it's going to become reality. I know they lied and they renamed the 4G, 5G and all of a sudden, but it's coming they just were well, they were buying time and and it's coming so it's coming reality and then with the 5g and 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 the ability to just log in and use vip um i think it's going to be brilliant um let me just share some sc screen and we'll talk about uh um, let me see how can i do that share screen right i'm using zoom because it's a brilliant uh, application by the way so let's share all right here we go so this is, this is, let's, let's look, every time I come in here, I'm telling you it's something else. <laughs> so this is the, what, what uh, uh, ShopMonkey is offering for $99. And we're going to see what we're offering for $99. Uh, it's unlimited invoices and which is we do um, unlimited text messaging and email. Basically we do, which is we do. Yeah, we do have SMS and email. Um, that's not a, that's not an option. Vendi code, we already have that reporting payments and three users. Let's see for $99 what you get with VIP. And that's the sad, the sad thing, man. And people still sign in. I don't understand. I, maybe it's the advertisement that's doing this. I don't get it. But let's see what VIP, the $99, what you get for the cloud. So we're only, this video is only about cloud. I'm not comparing the, the, the local database to that. So for the cloud, which is $99 a month, you get four users. How many you got here? Three users, right? Three, yeah, three user license. You got four with VIP. Actually, it's even open right now to five, which is I'm not even tracking it right now. As long as nobody trying to take advantage of it and may and have ten users, but as of right now, uh, four users and it could be five users, but four users guaranteed. Um, let's uh, let's keep looking, and let's see for the ninety nine dollars what you get. So you get the VIN decode, you get the license plate lookup, and you get the uh, the scanner. If you get, if you buy the scanner, you can scan uh, the uh, the VIN number and it decode it automatically. They don't have that feature. Uh, and uh, let's keep going. Unlimited estimates and invoice. We have that email service history. Uh, service history through Carfax, which is car basically Carfax integration. 
uh, if you go to the, sh the shop monkey right here they have it under 224 dollars and that's why i'm trying to wake people up wake up you don't see that <laughs> uh, seriously man carfax integration is already under 224 dollars keep that in mind that was 175 dollars uh, last year 224 dollars is it gonna to be 275 uh, uh, in 2022 we don't know i do know one thing that 335 million dollars they keep bragging about somebody's gonna pay it and the numbers doesn't add up i'm always about all the numbers and then the numbers don't add up they have i believe they said they're proud that they have 1200 customers and we have 1200 customers uh, they spend millions of dollars in advertisement uh, we spend zero money in advertising i don't advertise uh, my advertisement is the word of mouth uh, all i can do is uh, do my best um, have one shop be happy with our service and our our product and that shop is going to talk to someone else and that's how we keep going and that's how we keep going so we're, we're already all over the united states and canada there is no state um in the united states that, that, that there's no shop not using vip and pretty soon it's going to be there's no city uh, in the in the united states that are not using vip which is that's that's our goal pretty soon our goal, they have 1,200 uh, customers in 2021 20, uh, uh, with all the advertisement they're, they do it. Uh, we're going to have way more customers because, number one, we, we do support uh, the people who don't want cloud, number one, and who can afford the $99 or $400 a month, $500 a month. Uh, we have the one-time payment, $350. You don't have to worry about it. And you get updates and you're always up to date. Actually, I just released the final update today where it makes sure um, if you have the fifth generation um, you're gonna stay up to date from now on there is no I'm not I cannot wait on people to click on help and check for update it's not, it's not gonna happen so VIP right now will manage it from now on it's either it's arm if you leave the computer on it's gonna automatically update uh, from now on if you click on check for uh, update it's gonna do that in three days in three days VIP we'll check for update we'll we'll update whether he said yes or no because our our vip is it's not about hey let me just leave a let me stay on the old version and i don't have to worry about things no our job is to have it's like just like the website we want everybody to stay up to date and when everybody up to date that's why we don't charge for updates because we want everybody to stay up to date and that way we all win in the end uh, versus you you what if we have an error and you, you don't want to update and now you keep having in that error well sometimes we, it's not just about adding the new features it's about making sure there's no errors or whatsoever anyway so let's 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 keep looking so so let's give a print all chain stickers they don't have that we came up with uh, something called uh, let me see if i can grab this thing this thing right here it's the brother printer I mean, it works really good. It's $129 and it prints all chain stickers. I did that for my shop one time and I'm like, I'm sick and tired of, of write, handwriting the mileage and all that. I wanted something professional and we did that. Um, uh, cash drawer. They don't have these options. Again, I wonder, right, let me ask you a question now, whoever is watching. Why do you think, um, uh, shop monkey doesn't support cash drawer i'll tell you why you see when i integrated the cash drawer from hk system i didn't call hk system and says hey um, let's just partner up so we can make some money no i did not i went and found the, the a cash drawer that it's affordable and they have an sdk so we can uh integrate it to our shop management system Shop Monkey can do that. Why Shop Monkey can do that? Because Shop Monkey want to make money from everybody, and that's the problem. It's not about greed. It's about they cannot afford to go call people and say, "Hey, uh, let me integrate your product for free, and I'll, I'll I'll cause and I'll sell you I'll sell your product." I'm responsible. I don't know for how many printer all change sticker for people, man. There's so many people bought the printer from uh, from brother and i don't make any money on that nor i even i don't even send the link where you click on the link i don't make money on that i don't care i see that pennies to me it doesn't matter like i don't chase the stuff because if you focus on making pennies you always make pennies i don't believe in that so i don't care for that you can click on the link uh, when you click from vip to the link on amazon i don't make any money i'm not interested 
Um, cash drawer uh, system, like I said, they don't have that. They're never gonna have that. Uh, I don't know, maybe by 2030. Uh, I don't know, unless they partner with somebody, it ain't, it ain't gonna happen. So let's talk about inventory. We have general inventory and tires inventory. Let's go back to, to, to their webpage right here. And we can see under $224, I don't see inventory. Maybe I'm missing out. I don't see inventory. There is no inventory. Where are the inventory? Maybe I see it. Oh no, I apologize. It's right there. Inventory manager. So it is under two hundred still it's under two hundred and twenty-four dollars. From ninety-nine to two hundred and twenty-four dollars, that's not just paying twice, twice and twenty-four twenty-five dollars more. Oh actually twenty-six dollars more. So yeah. Two hundred and twenty-four dollars. So yeah, so they're they're again you're getting it with VIP with ninety-nine dollars. Let's keep going. Can job they have that quick buttons. They don't have quick buttons. Every if you ask any uh, VIP user, what's the best feature? One one of the best features of VIP though, I tell you, quick buttons. I love quick buttons. People keep telling me, Mark, can you add more than six? I can't add more than six because it will crowd the screen. Once that screen is crowded, uh, it's not really worth it. Basically, calendar and scheduling. We have that digital vehicle inspection. Let's see, do they have that with the ninety nine dollars? Nope, it's under 200 again. Basically, 224 and 99, like we're, everything we're offering it is under 224. Let's keep going. Scan D code, driver license. They don't have this feature. I do have this feature. Actually, we covered literally almost all states. And I always tell somebody if it's not working in your state, send me a driver license. <laughs> Just uh, somebody's driver license in the back so we can scan it and make sure. Uh, but the majority of the state it works Michigan, California, Florida, New York it works in New Jersey it works uh, people are taking advantage of it sometimes it's easier just to scan somebody's driver license and give you the name and their address instantly that's pretty cool um, fleet account I don't see that option you know I took it was such a hard thing to do let me see it doesn't even say fleet accounts managing fleet accounts I know they can make multiple payments on an invoice, which is we can do that, but I don't think they have fleet accounts. Um, yeah, I don't see it. Let's keep going. VIP self checking app. So many users are not taking advantage of it. I believe like we have probably 10, 20% of people are taking advantage of that. And whoever taking advantage of that, they're really smart. At my shop, I would not run without VIP or self checking app. The reason I say that, um, because it makes the customer excited to come to my shop. People who are used to come to my shop, they go sign in, they find their name, and they feel good. The cars pop up. That's my car, and and it's really cool. Let, let me just let's just show this real quick. Um, gonna put this aside this is the this is this VIP self checking out actually we just made it uh, available for the cloud users finally uh, for, if you're a cloud user all you have to do is just download VIP self checking app and basically just sign in that's how you don't have to do anything that's the beauty of VIP cloud you don't have to do anything you just sign in so when a customer come in right here it's pretty cool man there's a if he's a new customer he clicks on new customer if he's an existing customer he type in his phone number or her phone number and, uh, and and when the name pops up, man, people feel so good. I felt so good for years, and I'm telling you, man, people feel so good. That is me. <laughs> I do exist. So they click yes, and then here we go. The best part of it, the cars pops in. Oh, that's my car too. And then you, and, and you know, with the touch screen, obviously you just touch it. And right here is the best part of it. They say, what are they here for? I need all change and check. The front tire. It's making noise. And they click continue and right here your terms will pop in right here. We have a special terms actually on VIP uh, just for VIP self check-in. Uh, we'll, I'll show you in a second. Just click and then when they click I accept it sign their names and it says thank you for choosing VIP and it goes back to the home screen. When this happened 
Let's go back to VIP real quick. Again, we're showing the cloud version today. And when this happens, you just click on uh, on the uh, on right here. I have I've been testing so many of them, but here we go. It's gonna be in the blue. So anybody sign in with the VIP self check-in, it's gonna be in the blue, so you know that somebody signed in outside. It's always gonna be in the blue. And uh, like I said, I have too many of them, so I'm trying to figure out which one I did. <laughs> um, I apologize for that. Just too many, too much testing. That's why I gotta be testing all the time. Anyway, regardless, I can't. F it's, there's so many of them. That's why. Nineteen. Yep, that's one right here. So anyway, my, my point is, you you gotta be organized. But uh, yeah, so it's pretty cool, man. So they sign in. You, you, when you see it, it pops up on your screen and it says he. It's already written right here. So basically, uh, the customer created an estimate for you, and it's right there. And uh, I, I think that's awesome, man. And it says their customer request. Now you click on basic all change. You check their front tire, and when you're ready to cash them out, just click authorize, authorize, and pay. And if you have cash, pay. And print the simple you want to tell me you can do that with chalk monkey that's impossible man you're dealing with the web page you just like ordering pizza have you ever ordered pizza man it's it's with it's 2021 it's still harsh man every time I just want to hang myself whether their app on the phone oh, and any of all of them they're all that literally if you don't save your data it's horrible uh, unless you save this somehow and then you click next next maybe yes but no literally I always struggle ordering pizza on my phone sometimes I say let me just pick up my phone and and when you pick up your phone it depends who's answering the phone somebody who doesn't want to be there now you just say god help me I wish I ordered from the phone <laughs> anyway so let's go back to the comparison um, So yep, where we at? VIP self check-in integrated payment processing through Square Terminal. Um, this is one of the, I was one of the first who integrated Square Terminal um, with VIP. Let me just show you Square Terminal, which is, I think it's, the, the price keep going down by the way, Square. I saw it 220, maybe, I don't know, they changed, I don't know. It, sometimes it goes up, sometimes it goes down. It's 289 back to it. So this is Core Terminal. We're fully integrated with Core Terminal, meaning that if you want to open our repair shop right now, and back in the days you gotta be approved uh, with Chase. Literally, you gotta have good credit. You gotta be approved. Uh, no, there's no such thing anymore. Um, you just open uh, an account with Square, buy the buy the terminal for two three hundred dollars. Just to let you know, the terminal that I bought for Chase was five hundred dollars, and they were doing me a favor back then. It doesn't do any of these features that this one has. This one is $220, $289. It depends on, sometimes they run sales on it. And you open an account, you, you open a bank account, which is, that's easy to do. And you open, uh, you buy this terminal, you open a, a Square Terminal account and you, you connect your bank account to that. And that's it. And they do, they really, really deposit the, the money, the, I think the same day. So it's the same, basically the same feature if you have Chase or not. And the rates are 2.6 uh, plus uh, 10 cents, plus 10 cents, I believe, a transaction. And with Shop Monkey right here, right there, it's 2.7. 2 yeah, it's 2.7 plus 15 cents. Why the hell do I want to pay more, even, uh, even uh, more money? And I saw their terminal. You, know, you just want to hang yourself. I mean, it's like from 1965. Again, and that what pissed me off, people are signing up. How? How do you, you don't know VIP exists? Look at this, 2.7 plus 15 cents. They just wanna give, some people I think they just wanna throw their money. I, I don't get it. And look, this is the sad part. If you if we're, if you are with a genius monkey, which is, I, I call it stupid, you being stupid, <laughs> using genius monkey, no offense. Um, because $350, come on man. You get it for 2.5 plus 15, 15 cents. And their, their terminal, what is it for each device? $299 plus $10 a month. Are you kidding me? I mean, uh, do people do even look? 
Do you read? Do you, do you want me to wake you up? Wake up! $299 for the terminal plus $10 a month. Now they gotta make they wanna make money on the terminal. Oh my god, man. Man, okay, let me put it. I own the shop for seven years. They don't make that much money. I feel like I swear to God when I open VIP, look at this. I love it. VIP checking for update. <laughs> when I when I <laughs> when I open my own shop. I felt like everybody want to be part of my shop. My God, man. People, salesmen keep opening the door. Hey, how you doing? We want to be part of this. I felt at some point I was paying everybody by myself. If you're a shop owner, man, and you're a small shop owner and you have shop monkey, literally, man, you, you made the biggest mistake of your life. Number one, you're going to lose your data. You're going to lose your data because there, uh, somebody told me... Uh, I was trying to uh, sign up somebody from Canada and he told me he wanted to switch to us because he was sick and tired of $350. And I was like, can he, and his question was like, can you transfer the data from the shop monkey? I was like, if you have him in a, ser a certain way, so I need like the design of the database. And he said, yeah, yeah, they'll do that because they told me uh, they will do that for me special. I was like, okay, yeah, go ahead. And they did it. And my problem is now he's stuck. He gotta lose his data with VIP. If you wanna, if you wanna, let's say you can't afford the ninety-nine dollars a month, right? You have another option. You can buy VIP shop manual, three hundred fifty dollars one-time payment. Download your data and you keep going. You keep going. So what, you mean, business sometimes go down. What are you gonna do with the three hundred fifty dollars a month? Anyway, let's keep going. I'm not even done. Let's keep going. Parts lookup, parts lookup, and parts ordering. And let's talk about this. This is the major, major disaster with, with ShopMonk. Parts lookup right here. Parts lookup is under $350. So, hey, $224 users, they don't get to have the next part. They don't get that. They don't have into, first of all, number two, we do have uh, direct integration with AutoZone, which is nobody has it. I worked so hard to make this happen. Direct integration with AutoZone, basically you have the exact AutoZone website. Even though we can get it through next part, but we have the second option. At $350, we're offering whatever they offer at $350 on night with $99. I mean, you really, the math numbers do not lie. Why would you do that? <laughs> it's just like, uh, I don't know what's his name, man, uh, Sebastian. Uh, he's uh, the comedian is hell. Why would you do that? I'm telling you right here. Why would you do that? And always people talk about well mark. Um, I'm getting the labor lookup too. The labor lookup. I just made a video yesterday about labor lookup from Mitchell one which is causing you thousands of dollars and I showed the comparison if you get the labor lookup from next part versus the labor lookup from from Mitchell one. If I call you for a starter and you tell me $1,100 because your computer says $1,100 because the OEM prices, your computers from Mitchell One or, or, or All Data or, uh, or even Identifix is going to show you, um, it's going to show you uh, the, the, the prices OEM basically when I call the dealer. The reason I'm calling you because I don't want to spend $1,100. If I want to spend $1,100, I'll call the dealership and let them do it. This is not the same era like back in the days where people used to get away with it. Not anymore. Because the guy who is calling you right now for starter, he already called AutoZone. And he didn't have to call AutoZone. He just go on the website. See how much is it? AutoZone can deliver it to his house if you want it. It's a different era. You better have, you better have ready to go prices. And that's what I'm saying. So labor lookup and I tried to get it. They want so much money from it. I was like, forget you, man. I don't want it. With that price, I don't want it. So $350 a month versus $99 a month for VIP cloud version. And look how fast. How fast is it? Let's, let's go back to VIP and see if we can. Literally, this is the cloud version right now. I'm connected to the cloud. I don't know. Amazon. We use Amazon. AWS. Amazon, which is any major company uses Amazon. Let's see if I want to search for a customer. How fast is that? Look at this. It's really fast. Look at this. This is the car. I can't even see myself anymore. <laughs> it's really fast. 
basic all chain it's like the data is already on your computer basically I, I think that's brilliant but I'm not I'm not here's the thing people come sometimes think hey Mark's trying to push uh, the the Mark is trying to push the the cloud on not really I don't care you see I told you I'm making money either or it doesn't really matter if you want the cloud and you think the cloud fits your need then go ahead with the cloud I tell that to everybody if you think the one-time payment fits your needs and it's good enough then go ahead with the one-time payment um, do the clouds gonna get a little bit extra attention yes for one reason they're paying a month that's not, it's not like it's up to me. I have to give them a little bit extra attention. I have to, uh, because you know, they need, they need support more than the other, because when you have your own data on your own computer, I still help everybody. And I've helped thousands of people. Look, literally we have 1200 and I've helped, I helped them all. And I will continue to do so. But what I'm saying is a lot easier for me to help the cloud users for number one, uh, their data I'm available. I can see their data. I can connect to their data and fix anything at any moment. So it's a lot easier with with the with the regular like uh, one-time payment. I have to log into your computer. I have to have Team Viewer. If you send me mark, there's an error. I have to log into your computer. Versus if somebody tell me there's an error on the cloud, I don't have to connect. I don't have to bother them. I can fix it, and they won't even like be bothered. That's the beauty of the cloud because we're connected. I'm connected to all of them. In the end. I know one thing numbers don't lie numbers don't lie period for a small shop we have two three four mechanics and you're using shop monkey and uh, don't forget about shop monkey I'm sorry I mean the only reason I, maybe I'm stuck on the name it, it bothered me so much that somebody would name his own company shop monkey and uh, the whole stigma with shop monkey and mechanics and I'm a mechanic I'm always gonna be biased for mechanics. Now we're not monkeys. We're better than that. We're smart people who knows how to work on cars. Stop degrading us. But I don't know what he meant by it. Maybe it's just an advertising thing. But anyway, what I'm saying is whether it's shop monkey or, or or shop key or old data or I, I don't see it. I don't see it. For shop management, you need something simple. Number one, something works. You need something that works. VIP has been proven to work. Or I mean to prove into work, we have customers that sell over $2 million. So you have no excuse that to tell me my VIP doesn't know. But actually, those people, I've spoke to them and they said one thing to me, Mark. The only reason we use VIP because it's fast. Fast. Number two, it has to be simple. VIP is so simple. VIP is so simple just like your invoice. Just like when you used to handwrite receipts. It's the same thing. If you look... Let's just look, let's just pick up one, one customer right here. And if you look, there's, this is the customer information, customer, customer information, vehicle information right here. You guys can't see this part and parts and labor. It's simple, man. I, sometimes people, when they come up and ask me for questions because they're coming from a different uh, software, I'll be like, how did you use to handwrite invoices back in the days? You know what I mean? Don't make it more than what it is. I've said that from day one. It's just an invoice. It's just an invoice. Your job not to be looking at this and, and trying to make it more than what it is. Your job is to make money. That's it. Make money, man. Because in the, in the end, that's what matters. Let's go to the, our daily report right here. This is what matters. Like, what's what's your daily report for today? 466 is nothing. You know, this is just a test account, by the way. But yeah, so I I did have days like this when I had to run my shop. Sometimes it's slow. What are you gonna do? It's slow. This is what matters right here. So I, that's what I'm saying. You gotta you gotta care about your numbers. That's what matters. Your numbers, your net profit, and all that. And for whoever are using VIP, I just to let you know, they're, they're really at an advantage versus whoever is not using VIP. Everybody, sometimes I heard, I heard a commercial about uh, Bolton technology and saying how uh, they increase the profit 
uh, for somebody because they start using trust me any shop management can do that people tell me all the time mark our, our profit are going up why because yeah it's automated it's fast actually whoever have the fastest uh, shop management system wins and i believe ours is number one i think ours is number one it's faster than mitchell one it's faster than shop key which is basically are the same it's faster than shop monkey by a lot it's faster than uh, than uh, than bolt on technology because they don't have application most of them are they do have website and the website is built on on the, ours it's an application i like to see an application i like to see the button um uh, ours is made like um I always talk about we only support 1920 by 1080 as of right now once people start having 4k monitors uh, trust me i'll be on it but right now it's very few people i cannot start supporting a 4k and there's 10 customers have 4k uh, but yes ours what i mean by supporting 4k i don't let the the monitor resize everything I already know people think probably mark maybe you don't know that you can make it accept any monitor size and resize let me let me tell you let me show you what I'm talking about that's really important point that that maybe it will answer the questions let's put it as a shop monkey and in the end I'm gonna tell you why do I always talk about shop monkey <laughs> so this is the shop monkey website right so you notice as I as I as I open it and I close it, it kind of adjusts automatically, right? Only one problem is when I go small and start a certain screen, everything kind of go down and down, so it starts stacking. If you notice, those two are stacked on top of each other, and now they're not stacked anymore. So basically, they're pushing more down and down and down. And this is just a website. Imagine when you have real text. That, uh, text box now the, the text box like this that's why they always brag about their uh, their mobile version i look like i open their website on the mobile it looks horrible <laughs> literally it will take you two hours to finish the invoice and you won't even get it right because it don't work that way and that's why so because right, right the reason it doesn't work that way it works for a website don't get me wrong for a website it works but when you have text box and let's go back to vip so when you have text box right here and you start moving things around or start shrinking or expanding it makes everything looks weird and for me i was like all right what are we gonna do for the for the bigger screen because we we the standard right now is 1920 by 1080 and if you if you don't have 1920 by 1080 you've been missing so much for the past 10 years 19, i had 1920 by 1080 literally in 07 that's how long my laptop has been 1920 by 1080 from back in the days and uh, what I'm saying right now with the standard, if you go to uh, Costco, right, buy your sugar and buy a monitor, the monitor is 1920 by 1080. There's nothing special about it. Um, uh, the new ones right now are 4K, 2K, forget it. Uh, 4K, talk to me, 4K or 8K. And we will definitely support that. What I mean by that, I want, even if you open this in 4K, which is it will work with, win with Windows. If you have a 4K monitor right now and you set the, uh, the, the percentage to 200% you'll see exactly the same thing I want the button to be here stop not shrink and move the button start moving to the left or to the right yes that's what matters this is kind of stuff everything matters everything matters when you are in a, in a fast-paced process um what else I want to talk about yeah I, this is the last thing I want to say why Am I picking on Shop Monkey all the time? <laughs> I think some of my customers are ready now. Why do I even talk about Shop Monkey all the time? I'm always comparing Shop Monkey for one reason. I don't I don't know who Shop Monkey is. I did download their application, though I tested out. But it's not like why would I pick up on pick on on uh, on, on Shop Key or I don't know Shopware, all these wrenches and. Uh, why don't I do that? Okay, well, for number one reason, Shop Monkey has been advertising for the past, what, two or three years heavily. And uh, so when people search for Shop Monkey, um, they go and search for, uh, they see VIP underneath it. So they kind of helping us out. I appreciate it. Thank you, Shop Monkey, for continuing on advertisement. Once you stop probably advertising, I would leave you alone. <laughs> 
But no, really, just to, because um, here's the thing: the advertisement, ad advertising is really important, but it's really expensive. I mean, come on, Geico keep popping every three seconds. You know how many people those Geico have brainwashed? Where people say, "Oh, Geico, uh, <laughs> I need an insurance, Geico," but his brain is brainwashed. I can't watch any show until I, I have to see Geico ten times millions of dollars i don't respect that by the way uh, i don't respect uh, companies that keep uh, like they looking at us as an idiots and uh, you want to watch the show you want to watch the game here's geico in your face 10 times that is messed up and what pisses me off are the networks can't you pick up somebody else for it i think it's all about bidding and stuff or so whoever bids more why are you making me watch Geico 10 times? I get it. I understand. I get it. Do you see Apple Watch making uh, pop in every three seconds? All these shitty companies usually. There's something evil behind it. Geico State Farm is even worse. Every three seconds State Farm. Advertisement, they've ruined. I swear to God, advertising is really good. I, in the Super Bowl, I love watching the ads. I just want to see what else is new because we want to see what else is new. The good news, they don't play Geico. I think they do. I don't know. It's sad. Anyway, I appreciate you guys. I hope I helped somebody, man. In the end, this is what I, let me summarize this. What matters is the numbers. You need something that easy and works. VIP fits those too. You need to be more technical, we have it. You need a cloud, we have it. $99 a month for cloud or one-time payment, $350. That's it, man. You don't need to, you want to put your hands in the monkey's life? What if three, I'm telling you, it was 275 last month. Now it's three, last year, now it's 350. Not last year, in December it was 275. 335 million dollars they raised somebody's gonna pay this money it's you users anyway appreciate you guys until next time thanks for watching